Michigan's laws around reporting sexual assault are limiting. That's according to domestic violence advocates. Now work is being done to address that very issue. Our Elle Myers brings us to Lansing tonight to learn about a package of bills aiming to remove some of the pressure around reporting sexual assault. The Michigan legislature has its sights set on changing the way our state deals with sexual assault cases, more specifically expanding the time frame for people to come forward and report up to age 52. Now, earlier versions of similar legislation have failed, but this legislation introduced by state representative Julie Brixey does have some bipartisan support. The average age a child sex assault survivor discloses their abuse is 52. Let that sink in. Experts call that delayed disclosure, and it's pretty common. And delayed disclosure combined with our state's archaic statute of limitations law allows 86% of child sex abuse to go unreported. One expert tells me this package of bills would help improve current laws and address some misconceptions. The laws as they were before weren't recognizing that for most survivors of sexual violence, reporting right away isn't the norm. The package of nine bills is split into two categories, the first called Access to Justice, and the second, the Survivor's Bill of Rights. Access to Justice would retroactively allow a sexual assault survivor to file a civil lawsuit, even if the original reporting window had already closed, and increase the statute of limitations from age 28, where it stands today, to age 52. The bills have drawn bipartisan support. These bills address far too restrictive statutes of limitations and help bring Michigan in line with so many states who have been far more effective in securing justice for those who've been harmed. Dwyer Brownell tells me this legislation is a step in the right direction towards better supporting those who have experienced sexual assault. By extending those, those deadlines where they could uh, file a lawsuit, it's really coming more to term with what the reality is for survivors of sexual violence, which can help ease a lot of that self-blame, that guilt of not reporting. Now, Michigan isn't the only state looking to broaden its statute of limitations. Data from the Associated Press shows another 25 states have already approved similar laws. For now, reporting at the Michigan Capitol, I'm Elle Myers, CBS News, Detroit.